tonight when we started out, the first thing we had to communicate to all the agencies and make sure everyone was on the same page is that traffic wouldn't be coming at us when we started out on the road. And we had a meeting about that and the state agencies came together and came up with a plan and we didn't have one car come at us the whole evening, which is really unusual for a load this size through such a densely populated area. It's, it's unheard of. Number one is clear, we're good. Flights are cleared by about an inch. Yep, it just cleared nicely, so that's good. Well, we were actually uh, bringing a friend home of ours from the racetrack on Sunday morning. And as we drove over Lamont Bridge, we saw sitting down by the canal. I don't know. And um, that's where the research really started. We went online, figured out what it was, kind of found out when the move was going to be. And then tonight we kind of gathered, gathered a bunch of people up, sat in his driveway and watched it. With it. We were within five feet of it. Kind of awestruck. You've never, I've seen big things move, big pieces of equipment move, but nothing this large. And, and it was amazing how quiet everything was, even with the, all the trucks and lights and flashing, but it was just real surreal. And we're now we're in a new location, chasing the darn thing. Because it's like one of these opportunities that it's gonna be once in a lifetime as far as I'm concerned. Uh, and I just wanna see it go. So chances are tomorrow night, I'll be watching it go down the highway and who knows where I'll be after that watching it. It's, it's really hard to explain, but tonight just couldn't have gone any better than asked for. Everything we laid out on paper was performed as planned. And the, from the county to the state, they, they were really relieved to see that happen because when these guys do a good job, we all look really good.